A little low testing. Yo, what is going on? This is your boy Fluchax here. So this is the second video in relation to the game APB Reloaded. Uh, I cre I'm creating this small video in particular for people who have issues with trying to stream or record uh, their gameplay, but when they do so, it shows up as black bars on sides or uh, a certain aspect ratio that's locked. So in, or in order to fix that, right, I'm going to assume here that most of you guys out here are using NVIDIA or uh, GeForce, etc. GPUs and not AMD in particular. Um, but the process should be the same. So first, regardless of which Windows you're running, uh, you want to make sure you go into the display settings. Right? You can type display in the search or you could just right click and go on display. In short, you need to go into display, basically. Uh, first, you want to make sure that whatever monitor you're currently using, it's set to the default resolution or the particular resolution you want to be playing your game at. Um, currently, this is a 1440p monitor, but I have it set to 1080. Uh, so, yeah. Uh, go into your advanced display. Uh, you want to make sure that you're running the highest hertz for the monitor or refresh rate, which is also impacted as the amount of frames you get in a video game. Of course, there's other factors that roll into it, but this is one of the things that outlines it. Um, so in my case, I have four monitors. My gaming monitor is this one right here. Uh, as, you get, as you can see, it's a 2560 by 1440, but I have it set to 1080. And of course, maximum hertz, 165, so I have it set to that. If you have something lower, like anything lower than the top one, make sure you switch it to the top one, which is your max rate, and you want to keep it to that. All right, so once that is completed, go into NVIDIA Control Panel. Now this is, you will see NVIDIA Control Panel if you have a non-AMD GPU. So we're talking about NVIDIA. Go into uh, adjust desktop size and position and whichever monitor you're trying to change this to, so the monitor you're playing your game on, make sure the scaling is set to full screen. By default, it's probably set to aspect ratio and what this does is it locks it. Um, so when you play a game at a lower resolution than your monitor's resolution, right? So, for example, the monitor I have is 1440, but I choose to play games, especially competitive or multiplayer-based games, at a lower resolution, uh, so it performs a bit better or you have more frames. In, in short, more of an advantage over other people, if possible, right? Uh, you want to make sure you have a set to full screen because when you change the resolution from your monitor's native resolution, you will start seeing black bars at the side on the left screen right here and the right screen right here. And you'll see that when you're trying to stream it or record it to whatever platform you're trying to put that on. Um, but make sure that it's set to full screen. It's most important. And uh, of course, you can change this to GPU. Um, I assume it's actually better if you keep it at GPU. Um, because it deals with the display itself, so, you know, that's what the GPU is for, right? It's related to all that video-related stuff, but yeah. And that should be it. Once you have it set to that full screen mode, there should be a button down here that says apply or OK. Click on apply and then OK, and then that should be it. You should be good to go. You can exit out of it. Now, if you have an AMD GPU, um, I'm... I don't have a GPU for AMD. I am running uh, in my streaming rig here. I'm running a Ryzen 9 7950X, but I don't have a GPU in it because I do my encoding through the software, which is the CPU, the X264. And that's specifically why I bought the Ryzen 9 7950X, is to do the encoding on the CPU rather than buying a very expensive GPU. And anyways, you get my drift. But yeah. That should be it. You mean, if you want, you can restart the computer. Um, you don't need to, but in order for it to change or in order for it to take effect, and if you're doing this while the game is running, 
and you don't see it changed, I recommend you to restart the game. And then that should be it. And uh, yeah, if you guys have any questions or issues, feel free to hit them down in the comment sections down below. And uh, yeah, I'll do my best to get to them. But yeah, this is a real short and quick video on how to do that. But yeah, thanks for watching, y'all. Um, so some of you guys might not know, but I only come on three days out the week because I'm working the other four days full time. Um, I usually stream on Twitch. Uh, and sometimes I do multi-stream, so I'm streaming on Twitch, YouTube, Kick, TikTok, Instagram, X, and YouTube. But most, for the most part, every time I am streaming, I am for sure streaming on Twitch. So you guys can feel free to drop by and check out my channel whenever you want. It's at twitch.tv slash fluchax, and that's pretty much it. You guys can see up here at the top in the overlay uh, the different platform usernames that I go through. But yeah, that's pretty much it. Thanks for coming in and dropping by, and I uh, hope you guys have a good day, and I will see you all next time. Take care, y'all.